how are we feeling here? Oh yeah, we definitely have enough for one level up. Where are we going to put that level up? I mean, I think it's prudent to put it in strength and endurance, so I'm going to do it in endurance. Or in Looking a bit pale there. Wow. You making fun of my man? My dude? My my gigolo? Gigolo? Juggalo? There you go, it's a juggalo. It's not a gigolo. It could be a gigolo if you wanted to, I guess. I knew you'd be around He's got the musculature for it. It's like hard to look at him, though. <laughs> I would like to... buy... one of your... Titanite shards, there. I don't think I'm going to do a whole lot else with it. Alright. Travel. To Hyde's Tower of Flame. Is Dragon Rider the second boss you're supposed to fight? Does anyone know what the second boss I should be fighting is? By should, I mean like in difficulty curve style. Like... <laughs> like that horrible vampire movie based on the book I never read. There you go. I never read it either. I know a lot of people who did, though. I think I saw a part of one of the movies because my parents were watching it once. <laughs> I'm coming for you. Alright, then we have to get this guy over here so he doesn't attack us. While we're going through the fog wall. Because they can do that in this one. We don't have iframes. What's up, bud? Has to be Dragon Rider. Just punch him in the butt. Your weapon isn't effective at close range. Oh. Yet he jabbed me with it. Don't die! Yeah, the uppercut. Woo! Oh, I unlocked a pumpkin for a character. That is all. Yeah, I remember that character. A dragon Rider might literally be the easiest boss in this whole game. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I think it's true. <laughs> dragon Rider is like... Such a wimp. Such a baby man. <laughs> GG, well played easy. <laughs> I know, right? Just like... Walk around and uh, punch him in the butt. Until he dies. My name is Lysia. Lysia. I have come to spread the art of miracles, a practice of which I am a I don't care. I don't buy miracles. No need for the No need for miracles. Just you that's what You got it right. I'd hurt. I why did I come my and such is my only wish. Time. I think you have to talk I through all of her dialogue, right? I expected this. Okay, she, she's be repeating. Possibly. I remember I that. Done so soon. Yeah, I don't have anything to say to you. I'm not using miracles. Miracles are for the weak. Alright. So we go back, then we level up eight million times, get ourselves buff. Okay. So I think what like Our endurance needs to go up one. I think our strength could bother to go up two. I'm down with that. Slowly getting stronger. Meteor. 4 goes 85. We definitely need to be upgrading our uh, Cestus here. 
How much do we... No, no, I don't need to re reinforce weapon here. Uh, we need one more Titanite Shard, which we can do. And then we want to reinforce. Yeah. Yeah. So it looks like reinforcing is going to be our main way of getting upgrades here. So next one for this is... We need large Titanite Shards. So we should at least... 1600. We might be able to just use... Maybe we'll just use a um, one of our consumable souls here. Like if we use two of these, what does that put us at 800? That makes let's just get one. Um, we should use all three of these too. So just get all of these things. So yeah, we only needed 1600. We should be fine. Uh, buy items. We'll get. What is this? Repair powder. Why would I ever buy repair powder? Well, no. We only need three. Sorry for the, the waver and frame rate there for a second. That was, uh. That's... Oh, I'm an idiot. 1600 is not three times eight. Or three times 800. It's 2400. I was like, what? Why did that cost so much? Cause I'm dumb. Cool. I'll be around. Okay, what is our scaling looking like? 58 plus 86? It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Okay, we're gonna travel back here. There's some other stuff I want to check out here because I don't fully remember what's going on. And I think this is the better way to enter this level anyway because we don't have to fight as many big armored dudes. Hmm. Cool. Oh yeah, and there's a thing over here to do. Let's check that out. What's over here? Nothing. We are like luminescent, man. We are very bright. I'm like half man, half jellyfish. This is pretty sweet. Bum, bum, bum. It, it looks like I'm emitting white light onto everything around me. I will never need a torch, ever. You can even see it. Like, if I come back here, hopefully you can see it. But I have, like, this glow, like an aura around my character. That's how you know my power level is real high. Getting stronger. Oh, right. Okay, I know where we are. We will want to go back at some point here. Hit me with the backswing again. You bastards. Got him. Cool. The left bumper move when you're uh when you're using the the power stance Cestus here kinda destroys. It's pretty sweet. I'm into it. Pew pew! It's a big one two punch. We do I take some way more uh Stamina? No, it doesn't. It doesn't take that much more stamina. I don't know the downside then. You a night man over here? Okay, we can we can fight a night man. Watch him be harder than the dragon rider. Is this like the equivalent of the black knight? No, I thought that was the white night man. Okay, let's back it up. You've hit me enough times that I'm like, alright. Let's heal up for a second. Round two it is actually punch out. Kicked his ass. He got a good few good hits. Wasn't enough to save him. Okay, gotta make sure it wasn't a mimic. Can someone confirm or deny? Do metal mimics exist? Sublime bone dust. Doesn't that? That makes my uh, SS flask better. That's good stuff. Good work, team. We can now heal more. We already heal like most of our HP when we use one. Um, a little nervous. I don't know if I should be, but I am a little bit. I honestly, like, I remember Dragon Rider. I remember the other guy boss fight that I have to do over there. I really don't remember any of this. 
I remember like a little bit, like I, I recall some of the areas, but I don't, I don't know what like the next boss is or anything. Alright, what do we got? What do we got? Also, this is Scholar of the Last Sins, so there's different enemy placement. You just came out of the water! I didn't even see you. Really, you looked me out for those camouflage men, that was crazy. Oh, Basilisk, really? Right now? These guys are not dead. This makes me nervous. Just die. Okay. I think the main thing is I need to go a little bit more ham than I've been going. Going ham, I think, is the, the surefire way to get this shit done. Statue blocks are right. God damn it. I need like a. There's like special twigs or something that um, statue people. Okay, so. Can't go there yet. Oh, fuck me, no. This is the last place I want to be. Well, I get to meet a new NPC, so that's cool. Oh. I thought. I can't do this yet. There should be more games with weird creatures like Dark Souls has. I agree 100%. I'm really into the weird creatures. No. No Man's Wharf, no! <laughs> Oh god, there's gotta be other stuff we can do before we do No Man's Wharf, right? I can do, I can go do other things before No Man's Wharf. Um, yeah, okay, we, we still need to do the other stuff here. Oh dear. But no, I, Dark Souls? Dark Souls has weird creatures. Dark Souls 2, not so much. Occasionally. Um, but not as much. It's more like armored men. Um, Bloodborne, on the other hand, I think is amazing with the weird creature design. It might be why it's my favorite um, from software games so far. Where do I come? Where did I get up here from? Here, okay. Um, yeah, it might be my favorite from software game, just for the monster design, general art design. I'm very sad that I can't stream it, but that's what it is. Um, but Dark Souls One also has some crazy. No, oh, this man's alive now. Oh no. This is, uh. This is bad news bears. This is, oh, I had no idea. Okay, so killing Dragon Rider makes those guys come alive. Good news, everybody. I figured that one out. Bring it on. I'd rather fight White Knight Man in here. Or you. I'm okay with fighting you in here, too. Oh, jeez. Why are you awake now? This spooks me, man. I hate these guys. They're the fastest enemy in the games! And they're tanky! Why are you doing this to me, game? He has the clear advantage here. Oh god. Okay, it's an attack. Yeah. I was like, I saw him moving. I can't get an attack in without him getting one in, too. I have to wait for him to attack. This is very punch out. But I have to wait for, like, a big attack. I can't do a tiny attack, otherwise he's gonna get one in on me. He's too quick.
I ain't afraid. Never been afraid in my life. Don't put me in the fuck corridor. I saw you. Okay, that's a, that's a three hit combo. I have time. Yeah, killed him. Oh, okay, we're fine. Totally okay. No worries. Does that mean that all of them are gonna be like that? Oh dear, no. This is my least favorite thing. <laughs> Let us hope not. Let us pray that nothing terrible happens and that only that one was awake for some reason. Do they respawn? Does anyone know if they respawn? I, oh no! I see you hiding behind your big brother over there. Okay, it was a two hit combo. That wasn't the one we wanted. No, that's the three hit combo. That was a four or five hit combo? No. Nah, dog. You're, you're, you're cheesing me. They, they wake up when you kill Dragon Rider and they do respawn. Nuclear Mexican, I love you, man, but you really are the bearer of bad news today. This is the worst news I've heard all day. <laughs> no. Okay. Um. That sucks. I hate these guys. <laughs> oh, the five hit combo. It's everywhere. All right, we're done. We're done. I'm out. Sup, peoples and the hide knights. Yes, they do respawn. Well, I'm out. I'm out. King's derp. King derp's ghost. Welcome to the stream as well. Oh, this is terrible. This is terrible bad news. This is already making me rethink the idea of doing a, a dual Cessus run. Oh, man. Okay. Um, let's see if we can level up once. Maybe. And then uh, we'll head over to... I guess Fisherman's Wharf. I want to see how I'm going to do against the other... The Floaty Knight, man. Gotta hate the Hide Knight's counterattacks. Then wear armor. Yeah, I should wear armor. I just need to be fast because I can't block. Alright, but no, I agree. Okay, we can level up once. We're gonna go Vitality here. Or not Vitality, but Vigor. Scholar of the First Sin was fun. I have, this is my first time mucking about in it, so. I'm gonna start picking up, um, Titanite shards just in case I do decide to switch weapons and I need to upgrade it. So. Okay. Whew. Um. What do you think? Should we try... Fisherman's Wharf or Big Man with Floaty Floaty Man with Sword, whose name I don't remember for some reason. Let's try Big Floaty Man. We'll see. We'll see how he is. I don't think I've I don't think I've gotten myself strong enough to the point where it's gonna make it significantly easier so I can beat him. I mean, not that that's a point. There's always the the option of being good at Dark Souls, but here you're looking at the wrong dude. Yeah, there's a there's a couple. I haven't gotten that far in Dark Souls 2, like regular Dark Souls 2, because um, my old roommate used to have it. But I got far enough to notice a lot of the changes that have at least come up so far. They're kind of uh, some of them have been benign, some of them have been more of a pain in the ass. That was an amazing hit. Congrats to you. 
I don't even need a, need a quiver. You made one for me. The Pursuer. I don't know. I called him the Stalker the first time. Yeah, let's grab our souls here. Yeah, I'm not feeling too confident about this boss fight. I know I can use the ballistas here. Um... Don't do it. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't think I would dodge that, did you? Quick tip, Ziggy, don't get hit. I'm trying. But, again, if I was good at Dark Souls, it'd be... Don't float over the edge, you bastard. A stalker is just a more persistent pursuer. <laughs> I guess that's true. <laughs> And don't die, that's a great tip, yeah. Even if I don't get hit, I gotta make sure I don't die. Oh, I didn't dodge that. Okay, wait for him to do another big attack. Use Estus. Alright. No, he clipped me! Piece of shit. No! Well, I got him on that last one. Oh my god. That's where I've been getting lucky. Like, not getting hit by that piece of shit uh, stab attack. No! Heal. Heal. Stick to him. Can't believe you hit me with like the the last end of that shield. No. Did they reduce like the gravity well effect that was on that that sword? No! Hey, bud. Wrecked him! <laughs> Ring of Blades. Solar Pursuer. What the fuck? You guys weren't over here last time. What? Oh, you... Alright, I'm gonna run back. I don't want to deal with you guys yet. I'll come get the sword that's over here. Which might end up being the weapon that I use. Um... But, right now... Piece of shit. You see that little uh, stall jump I did there? Oh no, why'd I come back this direction? <laughs> this is maybe the worst way to come back. Alright, we're fine. Whew. Whew. No Cestus run. For the win, just get 99 strength. Yeah, <laughs> just punch people to death with 99 strength. Oh, oh shit. Alright. So, in all honesty, I've, I've tried to do a Cessna's run before, but I, I never really played this game very much. If you give up on this run, I will never forgive you. <laughs> okay, I won't, I promise. Um, but on a Cestus run, before I get a level up here, what do you guys recommend in terms of stats? Is, like, do I just go pure strength? Am I supposed to get some HP and endurance? Like, I think that's a, a no-brainer. Um, but, like, what am I looking for here? 
uh, in terms of stat stuff before I before I spend my souls on a level up here. Like I know they scale well. It's like a scaling on strength, right? Vitality, get HP. Okay. But vitality? Not vigor. One punch man style this. You want armor. Okay. So what kind of vitality are we looking at here? Like 10 100 push-ups in a 10 kilometer run. There you go. Okay, we'll get that up to 12. What else? So, I'm putting vitality up to 12. Fun fact, that works. <laughs> um, what else are you guys thinking? Endurance? Alright. Cool. I figured. Wasn't sure, though. Okay. So, let's see how we're doing roll-wise. Should be fine. Um, can I put on my tunic? <laughs> Old knight armor. <laughs> it looks sweet, but I'm also going to have to... That's not that bad. That's actually pretty good. I mean, it's not great. Okay, so without pants doesn't make that much of a difference. You think this roll is too slow? Is this like, is that medium roll or is that, I don't remember what rolls these are. If your equip load is below 70%, you will not fat roll. So how do we feel about this roll? Feel okay with this roll? Okay. We're at 23.2 out of 56.5. So we're like just below half or at half. It's it is acceptable. All right. We'll try to get more vitality and hopefully get our roll a little bit better on top of this. More armor you only on 30%. Really? I'm at 41.1%. Yeah. What can I go up to? Like 50? 75. Okay, you... I want 40%? Or I'm only at Does take an ass load of endurance to dodge though. 70% is max to not fat roll. Alright, well, I'm okay with the amount of armor we got on right now. We'll see how it handles for us. Um, so go close to 70? Yeah, but it's using, like, my. It takes more endurance now to roll. Right? Like. Let's just try to get up as high as we can. I'm pretty sure that if I, like... Oh, no, it does take the same amount. All right, we're good. Fifty percent is the next hit point, I believe. So, we do we want to keep it below fifty? So, I think I can do that. Let's keep it below fifty. We'll be okay. Um... All right, let's keep going. A little nervous to go to 
74, 70 percent is for fat rolls. Fifty percent is next point. Gotcha. Um. I don't know where I'm going, man. I, do I have to go to No Man's Wharf? Is that is that what's next? Next on the oh, I have to go back and get the stuff from the. That's right. Before we do that, let's go get the stuff. It's either more armor or less stamina consumption. Gotcha.